Today I'm going to try a Clyde Raider. It's basically a T Raider variant. This fly was first shown to me by Robert McGeoch, Clyde Angler. Um, it's a great looking fly and a lot of the boys swear by it in the Clyde and I've got a few fish on it myself as well. Um, so the hook I'm using is a Partridge Heavy Devil. This fly looks good on a gold hook as well, but I quite like a black hook as well on a Cascadia style fly. So I think the original one that Robert showed me had a black head, but I like fire orange thread, I use that for all my, nearly all my Cascade style flies. So first, catch a thread on. For the butt, all bright floss number four. Catch in your all bright. Take that down to rough about the point of the hook. Now I'm going to build up a wee. This an orange butt. Just gradually just twist the floss slightly when you're winding. Looks about alright. Tie that off. And what I do here is a wee bit of the old UV resin. And zap that with the torch. Gives you a nice wee shiny butt. The original I was showing was the butt and the body were varnished with Sally Hansen. But I've not got any time for that. I'd rather boot fishing. <laughs> so for the tail, I've started to ask year or two I've started using fluorescent yellow and all my cascades etc. Fluorescent yellow tail, fluorescent yellow hackle, I think it looks really good. Glows a wee bit better in the water. Just personal. I'm sure the yellow still works fine so I've got a wee, wee bunch of orange and yellow here. Then I'm just Put it in the hair stacker just to try and straighten, straighten the fibres up a bit. So length you're probably looking for around, I don't know, about twice the length of the hook. Just pinch and look. Yeah, we pressed in just to. Looks not bad. Tie that off. The 
flash I've started using this um, blue UV the camera doesn't pick up but it looks very good in the water it's almost like purpley the camera doesn't pick up at all but, but when you see it in the water it looks crying it's almost like a blue purpley I think it's Vineyard's UV blue flash a few strands of that Just roughly wind it up, tie it off for the rib and I'll be a bit of glow bright tie that underneath tie that off and for the body large mirage tinsel that stuff's brilliant eh? Really, really good. Looks stunning in the water. So, nice, nice and tight. Tie it off nice and tight. Cut my turns down, cut my turns back, trim that off. For rubbish, floss, so twist this, <coughs> tighten it up, and you got a little nicer rub at it, doesn't it? Doesn't it flatten out? Not much flying out but just keep twisting, keep the tension on it. Most of you got attention yet. Twist, twist, twist. Nice tight turn. Tie it off. Fold it back, tie it off. Tie that off. Then what I do it again. UV resin. We light. Dab on the needle and I just a wee light scrape on there. Underneath as well. A wee bit more. Again, again, is that the other touch? That body glows. <laughs> For the wing, I've got yellow squirrel tail. Um, I'm actually just about near the end of this, so I'm a smaller size for. I need to invest in a new one. I'm not really the biggest fan of squirrel tail and flies, but I don't really like tying it in. It's quite bulky and slippy. But anyway, I'm just cut off a wee bunch of that. Into the hair stacker. There we tap the table. And 
I'm very happy with that. Yeah, definitely need to invest in a new squirrel tail. It's all the fibers stand together. But... So the length you're looking for, I don't know about the length of the hook, I'd say. Maybe a wee bit longer is fine, but the length of the hook. So, take it to the length. Get a size, trim it. What I do here is a wee bit of super glue, a wee tiny bit, right onto the squirrel. Nice and quick, pinching look. Tie that in. A few wee straight fibres there, but no bother about them. And flash, I just use the same again. Blue UV. One, two, hold it back. One. That'll do me. Trim that to the same length as one. Now for hackle, the first just for the rest, yeah. This see your bit of UV torch on it glows. So selecting I like my hackles on my thighs quite small. So they're maybe coming down to about the point of the hook, maybe just slightly more. Just a personal thing, I think they look nicer. But whether it matters to the fish, I'm not too sure. Couple of tons down. I find it hard to keep a small head when I'm using a squirrel wing, but maybe that's just me. That's how I try and avoid it. Um, hackle pliers, if I could find them. Pull the fibres back. No one need one, maybe two of the yellow. So even it's, these are not the best feathers to be honest. It's just vineyards, Chinese and I've also tied these up to you about that. I've also tied these flies with badger. Eh, um, no badger. Yes, I saw a badger. Orange badger. Eh, um, hackle at the front. And they look um, really good as well. So, 
So we we'll go front hack up. What's this? A nice hot orange. on this. Play that in. One, two, hold it back. One, two. Your old one pound pre-max scissors. Hackle pliers. One. I'll do it. Nice tight tension. Tie that off. Tension. Any fibers going forward, just try and coax them back. Bit of wax. It's not too bad. You better shipper glue on the thread. Sometimes I work finish that something. Not too bad. Um, let that dry, trim the thread, we coat a UV resin, we coat a two varnish, and that's good to go. Nice wee cascade style. Clyde Raider. Body. Body shines really well in the water. Size 8 Clyde Raider. Thanks for watching.